Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Shanice T. And if you're not new here, thank you for coming back and thank you for clicking on this video. This video will be a clean girl, natural girl makeup look. This is my attempt of a natural girl look. If you've been to this channel before, you know how I normally do my makeup. So you know this is really me stripped back. Like I tried to strip back. I nearly went full glam but I had to take it back a few notches and this is my attempt. I actually really like it. I like how subtle my makeup is, how skin like the products are. Obviously I added lashes but they're short lashes so please like bear that in mind. But you can do this look without the lashes and it will still look you'll still look like that please like this video and don't forget to subscribe you know that big button down below like click that please in fact let me wait are you done also you can follow me on instagram and tiktok and twitter and we can talk there because i'm really active on social media like every day every day without fail so if you follow me and you want to connect those will be the platforms to connect so if you like this look this clean girl natural girl look stay tuned for the rest of the video and i'll catch you in the next one bye I'm going to use the got to be eyebrow gel to keep the two hairs i have in place just gonna use it and use the tip of the brush to flick up the hairs a bit to give the illusion that I have more than I actually have so now I'm going to color correct my dark areas even though this is a clean girl look I want to look clean and even evenly clean as you know I don't even need a lot of products anyway so just the smallest amount the colour corrector I used is the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Orange Corrector and I like to blend it into my skin I think I used a bit too much yeah I used too much it's okay I'm just gonna use a sponge to even it out so now I'm going to put on my foundation I'm going to use the NYX Can't Stop or Won't Stop foundation in the shade Deep Ebony I'm not going to put that everywhere I'm actually going to just put that in the areas that I colour corrected because every everything else looks even-ish and instead of using a brush I'm going to use a sponge to blend out my foundation because I feel like it gives a more skin-like finish I'm just looking into the mirror right now My hands dry oh my gosh I'm just using it to blend out my eyebrow um, concealer and that's the foundation let me just moisturize my hands because because I like, now I'm going to put on concealer and the concealer I'm going to use is the LA Girl Pro concealer in the shade beautiful bronze and I'm gonna put that just gonna put a little bit in each concealing area so under my eyes just a little bit my forehead a little bit and that's all I'm gonna put on and I'm gonna use my brush to blend it out and then I'm gonna finish it off with my sponge so I like to tap it just in the area that I applied the concealer I 
and spread it out a little bit. Okay, and for the under eye, just tap it and try to spread it out. I'm going to finish it off with the sponge and now I'm going to use the Elego Pro Concealer in the shade Fawn just to brighten it up a little bit and I'm going to use a smaller fluffy brush this really thick eyebrow brush this really thick one and I'm gonna tap it and keep it in the areas that I want highlighted and then finish it off with my sponge I feel like the form just brightens up under my eye and just makes me look more awake like I'm here I, I'm, I'm awake I'm awake hi <laughs> and just blend out the edges like I normally do oh and the oh so I'm going to skip the contour I'm just gonna set under my eye and the rest of my face. I'm going to set my under eye with the Huda Beauty Easy Bake Powder in the shade Blondie. I think I want to try baking, not baking, I think I want to try setting it with the concealer um, brush as well. I'm just gonna rub that on some tissue and tap into the powder, tap off the excess and just go in under. And I'm tapping and I'm bringing it out a bit. I'm doing little taps under my eye. And I'm going to use the Huda Beauty in the shade Cinnamon, Cinnamon Bun, the Easy Bake Powder. And I'm going to use the bottom of the sponge and I'm going to tap it in and tap it on my hand and then just cover the areas, other areas that are concealed. And now just blend it out with the angled brush. Swiping away anything that's left over from under my eye. And now I'm going to bronze with the Fenty Beauty bronzer in Mokamami and I'm going to use the Morphe R14 brush, this brush, and I'm going to take a little bit and tap it off and then just go in the areas that I would normally contour. To me, the bronzer gave a softer type of look. I'm going to use a smaller brush for the sides of my nose just from under my eyebrow down just the smallest amount just the side now just a touch of the MAC burnt pepper blush I'm gonna use a very fluffy brush so it's not so concentrated in one area <laughs> I 
and then a little on my nose now I'm going to move on to my eyes I'm going to do a basic liquid liner that means I'm not going to do a wing covering the lid so I'm going to start with the middle of my eye and then I'll go in inside okay yeah now I'll go inside and join the line then I'll just Okay, and that's the eyeliner done. First, I'm going to curl my lashes and I'm going to use the Maybelline, the Colossal Big Shot Mascara just to darken my eyelashes. And if you want, you can put on some lip gloss and stop here. I like, I like this. I actually really like this. I feel like I'm going to add some really short lashes. Now the glue on my eyelashes are tacky. I'm going to add them. I'm going to put them on. I'm just gonna put a bit of my bronzer. Normally I do this before my eyeliner and eyelashes, but I just remembered. So I'm just gonna tap my bronzer, tap it off, and then just go in my crease with my bronzer. And for my lips, I'm going to use the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Lava Cake just to line my lip. And I'm going to use the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Praline as my lip gloss. Yep, it matches my natural lip colour perfectly. And that's my face done. I'm going to use the Revolution Fix and Glow Spray as my setting spray. It has a dewy finish, so it, looks, it will look like my actual skin. Oh, that smells so nice. As that dries, I'm gonna fix my hair.
I'm just gonna put a little bronzer on my lace. Just a little bit. And then there we go. And that's the end of my clean girl look. I feel like I did well. Considering what I normally do every time I do makeup, this, this is a good balance between glam and but really natural, natural glam. It's like me, but just a little effort. You could do this without the lashes, but because I am who I am, I had to do at least a little lash. But yeah, this, I like this. So thank you for watching this video, I really hope you enjoyed it. All the products I used will be listed below. This top is from Pretty Little Thing. If it's still on the site, I will link it down below as well. If you like this hair, all the details about the hair will be right here. And I will see you in the next video. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe. You can follow me on Instagram at Shanice T. You can follow me on TikTok at Shanice T. And you can follow me on Twitter at Shanice T. That's it and I will catch you in the next video. Bye. Oh, since you're still here, why don't you check out these videos that I put here for you? Like, I put these here just for you. Just for you. So, check these out. <laughs>